All right, well, that was good. And we gotta check our messages. Who the heck are his parents? <laughs> Wait, what do you ask? This place is so nice. Tiffany, this is Melanie. You will not believe what happened today. Oh my God. I heard Tris say that you know who did you know what with you know who. Oh my God. Call me as soon as you get home. Like, okay, bye. Hmm. <laughs> Shut up, Duke. <laughs> oh, Mr. Frick. This is Mr. Frick from Carbuncle Elementary School. We've been having some discipline problems with your son, Willie, again. You probably shouldn't have called him Willie. Kids are making fun of him. My name is Frick. Please call me. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Sheila, this is Ms. Crabbleton. I ate something which didn't agree with me this afternoon, and it's really given me this green apple two-step, if you know what I mean. So I won't be able to give Willie and Brianna their music lessons today. Guess I should have known better than to have thirds on the fried chicken livers in the buffet line. <laughs> Live and learn. I don't know, I want Maggie Smith there for a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. It's preposterous. <clears throat> Hello, Jerry. Uh, I'm with the Employment Bureau. I'm calling for Mr. Jerry. Gordon Beamish. Uh, please call me Jerry. It's getting really dark. I don't know where to put my luggage. <laughs> uh, I seem to be mislocating everything. So my fans are not going to get that reference. That's okay. If that you see from, the streams, it's all good. That was from the Scratches stream where you call Jerry over and over and over again. <laughs> <laughs> Can you play a really dumb, like, surfer guy? Uh, teenager? Tiffany, uh, this is Cliff, and I was just calling to see if you wanted to go see the Gums and Noses concert. Me, Friday night, call me when you get a chance. Bye. <laughs> I like how everything ends with a question. <laughs> Bye? <laughs> it's like Keanu Reeves. Beep, there are no new messages. Beep, thank you. Thank you, answering machine. Look at this lovely phallus. You know, there it's was great. a phallic cactus in the classroom, too. I think they're trying to tell us something. Willy, horny. Yeah. Cactus. Frick. Frick. <laughs> it's this game. I don't know. I love this game. Holy Ooh, crap. Milf. What is that? That's a hot mama. Hey. How was your last day of school, dear? All right. Great, great. mom. Great. I'm Willy. <laughs> Get out of here. No, no, no. Great, Mom. Just great. <laughs> Duffy, what's up? I'm a lucky dog to have such a nice master like Willy. Aww. It's great to be free from the ravages of intelligence. <laughs> that does sound like something Duke would say in some alternate. <laughs> what a life. Sleep all day, chase cats, bark at the mailman. It's a dog's life. His dog. He has so many cool things to say. <laughs> Maybe we'll just talk to the mom a little bit here. The MILF. Seriously. I'm glad you're home. I'm up to my ears, and I really need your help. Yeah, that sounds a little not in context. Let's move <laughs> This is a little kid. Oh, okay. Mom, I just got home, and I gotta unwind. <laughs> you can play Brianna. Mom, I wanna go outside and play! <laughs> okay, you're not Brianna. Okay, I don't think so. Now it's what you get. Brianna, you'll have to wait. That furrowed brow. <laughs> Look at that, it's that curling in four be... different ways. <laughs> they look like pube hairs on the side Stop. of a... Well, they do. No. They're so curly. Anyway. Willie, you can unwind after you help me. Brianna's been whining all afternoon. Get her out of my hair before I go crazy. Just take her into the backyard for a little while. No way, Mom. Brianna's a real pain. Then grab that Jinsu knife and over there. And kill her. <laughs> And Julian those veggies for dinner. No can do. I gotta practice Nantari. You know the championships are coming up and I need all the practice I can get. Don't. <laughs> do not. Do not. Mother, you promised me that Willie would take me outside to play. What, is she like the orphan child? Yes. Of a, just adopted child? Bring me some more. She's the red-headed stepchild. Bring me some more. Redhead. Brianna, I'm starting to lose my patience. Now, just be quiet or else. Alternate reality, April O'Neil. So, you know what? Actually, you have to do one of these things. So, we can either take Brianna out or we can, like, chop get to things work. up with knives. You know what? Let's just push Brianna on the swings. Oh, she's smiling. It's our little sister. Yeah. 
Oh, we that's that's are good. Family. I got my one sister in me. Change the lyrics, pretty good, huh? Make it works. Shit up on the spot. Push harder, Willie. I wanna go higher. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> you really wanna go higher? Push her into the sky. We can mess this up too. Really? And I didn't save my game, but I might be able to. Yeah, right, let's. I might be able to do it. So, let's save this as Brianna. I think we can actually like push her too hard, and like spin, like have her spin. Like murder. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, like murder. <laughs> I don't know. It's more like manslaughter, I guess. Hi, Willie. Well, you know. Here we go. Whoa! Oh my word. Ah! <laughs> Brianna, no. Well, she's that's gone. sad. That's. <laughs> oh, oh my well, god. I guess she's dead. She would just kill her. Oh, she's okay. Oh, fingers. Look what you did to your little sister. Traumatized forever. Oh man. Not hurt enough What's to not be able to. What's up with the hot nurse? Good grief, look at them! Yeah. All four of these people, I mean. I mean, look at those people. Uh-huh. I don't know what's gotten into him. It must be all that Nintari. It's turned his brains into guacamole. Oh, man. That boy needs a firm hand. Have you folks considered sending William to military school? Everyone! Yep. Oh, sending him to Willie's... Mm. Military school all the time, huh? It's not every time. Like, there's different ending... Uh, endings losing ending so it's just the same thing you get your head shaved so let's restore and not send Brianna yeah let's not kill our sister almost we didn't kill her we just broke both arms oh, almost I mean when I was it young my, much worse when I was young my brother swung me around by my arms too too like too fast or something and my arm popped out of the socket mm. and I had to pop it back in it happened to me too it's not cool man Except what happened to me was I was walking in the mall with my dad and for some reason I just you know I was holding his hand for some reason I decided to just just, just drop like dead weight <laughs> and he was like hold, you know and I was still holding what, were on were you being dramatic or something I have no idea what I was doing I was like six I looked at him all weird and thought it was like child abuse and stuff it's pretty Ooh. bad oh Willie oh Willie so we said no and honestly, I think we might have to get the Jinsu knife and cut anyway. Oh, really? <laughs> um. <laughs> okay. Yes, we, yes. Oh, Mom. Jinsu. Oh, Mom. <laughs> Ma'am. Yeah, we have to do it anyway. He is cutting towards himself, isn't he? Oh. No, he's not, but he's an idiot anyway. Careful now, that knife's made of real carbon steel, and it's so sharp it can cut through a... Yeah, yeah, I know. It's so sharp, it can cut through a shoe. It's one of those infomercial knives. You could, like, do something... Oh, no. Blood. Oh, my thumb. Mom. Mom, I'm bleeding. Call the paramedics. This looks serious. It kind of does. It's splurting everywhere. Yeah, that's kind of an artery. Oh, don't be such a baby. It's just a little nick. Nicholas. It's throbbing. I feel faint. Don't make such a big deal out of it. You're beginning to sound like Brianna. Just go upstairs and take care of it. You're bleeding all over the veggies. Mmm, marinara sauce. That knife looked rusty, Mom. You think I ought to put iodine on it? I don't care what you do as long as you don't make a mess up there. She's so concerned. Bad, mo bad Mom. <laughs> Tina, bring me the axe. Jeez. <laughs> no more wire hangers. <laughs> All right, uh, we can mess this up too because if okay, it's knife. yeah, I mean the knife is rusty. I think I don't know where I'm going. I'm like I'm trying to find the stairs. It was back in the main hallway, wasn't it? It was, and I, I yeah, think it's let's go back way. the other way. But yeah, your finger can get infected because it, the knife was rusty. It's made from carbon steel and it's rusty. That's intriguing. Or I don't know. You can get an infection. You know how it goes. You eh, cut your finger. Yeah, no. Okay, let's take care of this. Walk, walk, walk. <laughs> He's walking like a boss, though. Strut. It's like, yeah, I'm bleeding. I'm bleeding. All over the veggies. All right, one of these rooms is the bathroom. I believe it's this one. That looks like a bathroom. It's blue. 
yeah. I mean, my bathroom was blue growing up. Well, actually, it's green. So, okay. What do we... What is the protocol for uh, bandaging a finger? Fingers. Uh... Well, what's what's that little... There's like a thing of stuff over there to the left. This? What, no. What, uh, this? Left. Yeah, what's no, that? there's nothing in there. Oh. I think we gotta go in here. Well, there's like after dinner mints, matches, condoms. Oh, here we go. Germ away. So let's put the germ away on there first. Yeah. Ugh, this iodine looks really gross. Okay, so we're gonna... You can choose not to do it, but we're gonna do it, obviously. It's green? Iodine is totally not green, but that's okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm in agony. Man, does this stuff hurt? And then band-aid. Sweet. And we did it. This is edutainment. <laughs> Pushing up roses and LGR teaching you how to bandage your finger. Absolutely. So th I think that's all we need to do there. And I don't think I missed a step. I didn't even see any other steps. I didn't even see anything else to click on. So. I hope we didn't have to like wash it out with antibacterial soap first. Mm -hmm. That might be a little too, a little too complicated. Pretty sure the sink was a duck anyway. Like, go to the store, get some Neutrogena bar soap, wash <laughs> it, pick out the correct brand of iodine, let it set for five minutes. Okay, so now let's find something to do. Like... I don't know, you gotta create your own life. Nintari? Yes, actually. That would be the thing to do. Oh, look. That's not creepy. It's Grandpa Dead. Or whoever his name is. I thought you were gonna say Grandpa Dick. Dick. Like, he's not a dick. Well, it could be. I mean... <laughs> it could be Willy. with this game. Yeah. Horny. Willy. Hottie McNursenson. Yes. Well, his room. No sisters. Oh, okay. No so sisters allowed. So he has allowed. a thing against nuns. <laughs> Alright. Wow, this kid's room is like pretty great. But he has um, a Star Trek Inter like Star Starship Enterprise right I over there. I found some flies. He's got an F-16 in the top left. Okay. I got a jar of flies. Jar of flies. That's good. Which is a great Alice in Chains album. It is. No excuses. So we can go to bed, but it's too early. So let's play our Nintari. All right. Nothing like a little Nintari action. I haven't played for at least eight hours. <laughs> Since before school. That's how I feel about King's Quest Three. True. You were just playing it. I wonder what game we have. Nintari! Commander Keen 4, perhaps, or some... What? What? Monster Squad! <laughs> it's got an eyeball! Whoa. Oh, are we supposed to do anything, or nope. we just watch? We're just watching the greatness of this game. I mean, it's pretty much Commander Keen. <laughs> yeah, it's the same thing. Same game. How did they get that licensed? At least Kane Dreams got veggies and stuff. That was a cupcake. Well, he threw a carrot or something. Willie, time for dinner. She says everything in a breathy tone, even yelling. <laughs> We're serving asparagus and blood. <laughs> <laughs> She's the hot mom. She's the MILF, you know? She doesn't care. I'm gonna be like that when I'm 47. I don't know how old she is there. She's probably not 47. I would imagine not. I mean, my parents were older, it could be. Let's see, if I were food, where would I be for dinner? Probably the dining room. I would say you're correct. We actually used to eat in the kitchen, though. Yeah, we would we do, do that, that occasionally. I mean, it depends if you have one of those little bar thingies. Mm -hmm. We had a table like an like island. in the kitchen. Oh. All right, our family. There's oh, no man. father figure. <laughs> Dinner looks great, Mom. What is it? <laughs> Not answering. Where's your father? Everyone's always late around here. Oh, well, I'll just let you handle that, Clint. Siest vegetable I was pretty good. Ah, oh, we vee. Shut up, Evil, you little show off. Très bien, Brianna. Willie, don't talk to your sister that way. Your dad should be getting home by now. I bet he's got that big promotion. Hmm. You know, Tiffany? That's our sister. Mm. You know, like, Cliff's father is like a millionaire, and he's not as old as daddy. He made his fortune in women's lingerie. I'll bet he <laughs> looks pretty cute in it, too. Hey, that was a good one. 
Cliff's father takes the whole family to the south of France like every summer. Oh my god. I think he's going to ask me to come along this year. Over my dead body. Cliff is like so intellectual. You know what I mean? You're scary good at that? <laughs> oh, thank you. Then what's he doing with you? <laughs> Stop arguing and eat. And remember, not a word about your dad's surprise party. Gordon, a vice president. Just think of the prestige. The money. And he's not even 40 yet. Mm, I sugar mm, daddy. Good. When he comes home, let's all let him know how much we love him. There he is. Waldo. From Where's Waldo? Yes. Living in the Cleaver family. Beaver family? Cleaver? I don't know. Leave it to Be Beaver. Beaver, Beaver Cleaver. Cleaver. Whatever. Yeah. Hi, daddy. Hi. Hi, honey. Hi, kids. Hey, Dad, congratulations on your promotion. <laughs> Daddy, we're like so proud of you. Oh my god. Something. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your contribution. <laughs> I'm going to cut out all this laughing. Oh, you got to leave it in. It's great. Well, when do you start your new job, Mr. Vice President? Dad, can I have the 2,500 bucks I need to go to the Dentari Championships? Can I get a new car when I get my driver's license? Oh, Gordon, now we can take that cruise to the Galapagos Islands. I actually lost my job. Oh, Gordon! Oh! Now oh, he's getting up for the talk. I'm afraid I've got some bad news. The agency let me go today. What? Frick. The old man said he's gonna downsize the agency. Restructure. He said public relations is in a period of negative accelerated growth. That would not be good. Then he gave oh. my job to a guy four years younger than me and with a slightly deeper hairline. You mean you got fired? Just like that? I'm worthless now. We're getting a divorce. I'm a failure. I'm nearly 40 and out of a job. What am I going to do? Nintari. <laughs> oh my god. Daddy has been pink slipped? Don't worry, kids. People lose their jobs every day. I'm sure your father has a contingency plan. R right, dear? Well, it involves some very unscrupulous dealing. I may have to deal meth. What if... <laughs> What do you mean? How are we supposed to make the mortgage and car payments on selling meth? How are we going to pay for Brianna's gifted preschool program, or, or the credit cards, or my facials, or my nail wraps? We start with respecting the chemistry. <laughs> or Tiffany's nose job. Can you still give me the $2,500 <laughs> I need to get to the Nantari Championships? Sorry, son. It's time to cut back. I am the one who knocks. Tighten the belt. When we get back on our feet, we'll take another look, okay? But the championships will be over. There's always, like, five more. <laughs> we have to make some changes around here, you know? Sacrifices. It's only temporary. This is getting really serious, guys. Oh, my God. Sitting down. Well, it's time to watch TV. See, um... Hey, Ooh. anyone seen the mail? Not that I care. Like, I brought it in when I came home from school. Here it is. School. Thanks, hon. Bills, bills, more bills. Whatever happened to junk mail? Hey, something from Carbuncle School. Frick. Wonder if it's the invitation to the frick. <laughs> Baseball. <laughs> softball game. The father-son softball Father -son game. Father-son softball game. What's the C in music appreciation? Seriously, how do you get a C in music appreciation? I'm just as confused. <laughs> like, you'd have to be a total jerk to get a C in music appreciation. You know, Cliff can play the piano with, like, one hand. Oh, my God. Is that a euphemism? What's he doing with the other hand? Man, I'm on the same wavelength as these guys. <laughs> well, Cliff doesn't waste his life playing stupid Atari, you know. I ain't playing with a joystick, though. It's not stupid. It's really good for my eye-hand coordination. Gordon, I warned you the moment you brought that Nantari game into the house. But, Mom... Dad... I don't... What, what, is it, what am I holding? What, 
what? You'll see. It's a okay. key. Uh, here. Uh, take the entire key. Lock the damn thing up. I'm the boss around here, and what I say goes. Yeah, that rem- chin is so big. <laughs> Remember when um when Atari's had keys like in locks, and you can lock no. lock it up? No. No, I don't. <laughs> Consider it locked, Dad. Like, oh my God. Like maybe the case it's in. I gotta get that key back. If I can't practice, I'll never win the championship. My computer had a key, but we yeah, lost it. Yeah, mine did too. Mine. Yeah. Willie, get back here right now. We haven't. You haven't been excused yet. Then may, may I, I please be excused? Ooh, a little spelling. Oh, error. you gotta see in English too. <laughs> Pronunciation. Hmm. No, not until we're all finished with dinner. Quiet, everyone. I want to hear this. Oh, don't worry. I've taken care of that. I placed an ad for a new spokesman for Toot Sweet. Yeah, so? So all we have to do is wait for some gullible sap and we can u- we can use as a fall guy to knock on our door. Like you've had a drink too many. <laughs> 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 cigars. 